India, a country rich in culture, diversity, and history, has long been known for its remarkable contributions to the world. But, have you ever imagined India as a superpower? A country that leads not only in its region but globally in economic, political, and military strength. Well, the future is closer than we think. Join us as we explore the factors that will make India a superpower in the making, and the impact it will have on the world stage. Now, of course, India still has many problems to solve, but we will focus on the things that could turn India into a future superpower. First, let's see what exactly a superpower means. A superpower is a country with a dominant position and with the ability to exert influence or project power on a global scale through the combined means of military, economic, diplomatic, technological, and cultural influence. By this definition, the only superpower right now is the US, and most likely the second one will be China in a few years. With all these in mind let's see why India can become a superpower. But before we start please give a like and write in the comments in which year you think India will be a superpower. Now one of the most important things when we talk about a superpower is the economy and by this criteria India is situated very well. With a nominal gross domestic product of $3.4 trillion and a population of over 1.4 billion people, India's economy is not only large but also diversified. India's economy is the fifth largest in the world, after the United States, China, Japan, and Germany. In terms of nominal GDP, the country has surpassed several developed countries, including France, the United Kingdom, and Italy. Moreover, India's economy is expected to grow even further, and by 2035, it is projected to become the third largest in the world after the US and China. India is one of the fastest growing economy, with a growth rate of over 7% in 2022. This growth has been fueled by a combination of factors, including a large and growing consumer market, an increasing middle class, and a highly skilled workforce. As a result, India is quickly emerging as a major player on the world stage and is being seen as a potential superpower. The growing economy has had a significant impact on the lives of people in India with more and more people being lifted out of poverty and entering the middle class. This has created a massive consumer market, which has in turn attracted investment from companies around the world. This investment has led to the creation of new jobs and businesses, further fueling the growth of the economy. India's economy has grown at a rapid pace over the past few decades. Between 2000 and 2020, the country's nominal GDP grew at a compound annual growth rate of 7.5%, making it one of the fastest growing economies in the world. Despite the economic slowdown caused by the COVID-19 pandemic, India's economy is expected to bounce back, and the government has announced several measures to revive growth. The Indian economy is driven by several sectors, including agriculture, manufacturing, services, and IT, of which agriculture is the backbone of India's economy, as it employs over 50% of the country's workforce. The sector has shown significant growth in recent years, India is the largest producer of milk, jute, and pulses, and has the world's second largest cattle population with 170 million animals. Another key part of India's continued rise will be its ability to grow its manufacturing sector and challenge China as the world's number one exporter. India has already benefited from a large, well-educated, often English-speaking middle class, helping the country to develop world-class IT and pharmaceutical sectors. It also has strong consumer demand which accounts for about 55% of the economy compared with less than 40% in China. We talked about production and numbers. But let's not forget that one of the most important things for a country's economy is its geographical position, and again India's position is very advantageous. India's strategic location makes it an important player in the global economy. The country is located at the crossroads of major trade routes between Asia, Europe, and the Middle East, and this provides it with unique advantages in terms of access to markets and resources. India's location has allowed it to establish itself as a hub for trade and commerce, and this has led to the growth of its ports, airports, and other transportation infrastructure. This infrastructure is helping to connect India with the rest of the world, making it easier for companies to do business and access markets. India's strategic location is also helping to establish the country as a major player in the energy sector. India is located near major oil and gas producing countries, and this provides it with access to a key resource that is critical for economic growth. The Indian government recognizes the strategic importance of the country's location and is taking steps to further leverage this advantage. For example, the government is investing in transportation infrastructure such as roads, ports, and airports to make it easier for companies to access markets. The government is also working to establish closer trade and economic ties with other countries in the region, such as China and the Middle East, to further enhance its strategic position. India is also blessed with a wealth of natural resources, including minerals, forests, and fertile farmland. These resources have played a critical role in the country's economic growth and have helped to establish India as a major player in the global economy. One of the most important of India's natural resources is its vast mineral deposits. 
The country is rich in minerals such as iron ore, coal, and precious metals, and these resources have helped to fuel its industrial growth. The mining sector has grown dramatically in recent years, and this has created jobs and generated revenue for the country. India's forests are another critical resource, providing the country with a valuable source of timber as well as a home for wildlife and a place for people to enjoy nature. India's fertile farmland is also a critical resource, providing the country with a reliable source of food and helping to ensure food security. The government is working to improve agricultural productivity and to support farmers through programs such as irrigation, seed distribution, and market support. India is home to over 1.4 billion people, making it the most populous country in the world. This large population is a significant asset for India, as it provides a massive consumer market and a large pool of labor. As a result, India is emerging as a major player on the world stage and is being seen as a potential superpower. The growing middle class in India represents a massive consumer market, which has attracted investment from many companies. This investment has led to the creation of new jobs and businesses, further fueling economic growth. The rise of the middle class is also having a positive impact on the quality of life for people in India. With more disposable income, people can improve their standard of living and access better healthcare, education, and other services. This, in turn, is leading to increased social and economic mobility. In addition to its consumer market, India's large population provides a significant pool of labor. This includes a large number of highly skilled and educated workers in fields such as IT, engineering, and science. This skilled workforce has been a key factor in the growth of India's technology sector, which is now one of the largest in the world. The large population has also been a driving force in India's rapid urbanization. India is undergoing a period of rapid urbanization, with millions of people moving from rural areas to cities in search of better job opportunities and improved living standards. This trend is transforming the country and shaping its future in important ways and has led to the development of new urban centers and the expansion of existing ones, as well as increased demand for housing, transportation, and other urban infrastructure. The rapid growth of cities is also changing the social and cultural fabric of India. Cities are becoming more diverse and cosmopolitan, with people from different regions, backgrounds, and cultures coming together to create a vibrant and dynamic urban environment. This is leading to new forms of cultural expression, as well as new challenges and opportunities. Rapid urbanization is also having a major impact on the environment, with the growth of cities putting increasing pressure on natural resources, including water, air, and energy. One of the most important partnerships for India is with the United States. The two countries have a strong and growing relationship, built on shared values and a commitment to democracy, pluralism, and the rule of law. The relationship is further strengthened by India's emergence as a major global economy, with a fast-growing middle class and increasing innovation and entrepreneurship. India is also a key player in the BRICS group, which includes Brazil, Russia, India, China, and South Africa. This grouping represents some of the largest and fastest-growing economies in the world and provides a platform for these countries to collaborate and influence the global economic and political discourse. India has been a strong advocate for reforms in international institutions, such as the World Trade Organization and the United Nations, to reflect the changing dynamics of the global economy. In addition to its partnerships with individual countries, India is also an active member of several international organizations, such as the United Nations, the World Trade Organization, the International Monetary Fund, and the World Bank. India's membership in these organizations has allowed it to play a more significant role in shaping global policies and addressing global challenges such as poverty, climate change, and terrorism. India is also a founding member of the Non-Aligned Movement, a group of countries that advocate for peace, justice, and equality in international relations. The NAM provides a platform for India to showcase its commitment to peace and stability in the region and to build partnerships with other countries on issues such as sustainable development and human rights. As one of the world's largest and fastest growing economies, India has made significant investments in its military over the past few decades. With a total of 1.4 million active personnel and a defense budget of over $70 billion, India's military is considered to be one of the most powerful in the world. In terms of global rankings, India's military is the fourth largest, behind only the United States, Russia, and China. This size and strength give India significant power and prestige on the global stage and allow it to play a more influential role in shaping the security environment in the region and beyond. One of the key components of India's military is its army, which is well equipped with a range of modern weapons and equipment. The army is capable of operating in a wide range of environments, from the high-altitude Himalayas to the tropical forests of the Northeast. 
With a growing focus on special operations and counterterrorism, the Indian Army is set to play an increasingly important role in securing India's interests and ensuring its people are safe and secure. The Indian Navy is another key component of India's military, with a modern and growing fleet of ships, submarines, and aircraft. The Navy is responsible for defending India's maritime interests and for maintaining the security of India's coastal areas and exclusive economic zones. With a growing focus on blue water capability, the Indian Navy is set to play an increasingly important role in shaping the security environment in the Indian Ocean region. And of course, Indian has a modern and well-equipped air force with a range of fighter jets, transport aircraft, and helicopters. The air force plays a key role in securing India's airspace and in supporting the army and navy in a wide range of operations. With a growing focus on aerospace capability, the Indian Air Force is set to play an increasingly important role in the years ahead. In addition to its conventional military capability, India is also a nuclear-powered nation with a growing arsenal of nuclear weapons. This gives India a significant deterrent against potential aggressors and helps to ensure stability in the region. India has made significant investments in research and development over the past few decades. With a total R&D budget of over $10 billion, India is quickly becoming a major player in the global technology landscape. India ranks third among the most attractive investment destinations for technology transactions in the world. With more and more multinational companies setting up their R&D centers in India, the sector has seen an uptrend in investment in recent years. One of the key drivers of India's R&D efforts is its vibrant technology sector, which is home to some of the world's leading tech companies and startups. Companies like Tata Consultancy Services, Infosys, and Wipro are helping to drive innovation and growth in the country, while young startups like Flipkart and Paytm are shaping the future of e-commerce and digital payments. Also, India has some universities and research institutes, which are home to some of the world's leading scientists and engineers. With a focus on cutting-edge fields like biotechnology, artificial intelligence, and materials science, these institutions are helping to drive innovation and breakthroughs in a wide range of fields. India's technology industry has grown dramatically in recent years, and it is now one of the largest in the world. This sector is a key contributor to India's economic growth and is playing a major role in the country's rise as a potential superpower. The technology industry in India has been driven by a large pool of highly skilled and educated workers. These workers are able to deliver high-quality software and services at a lower cost than their counterparts in other countries, making India an attractive destination for many companies. And besides these India has its own space program, which has made significant strides over the past few decades. With a focus on low-cost and innovative solutions, the Indian Space Research Organization has become a major player in the global space landscape, is among the top countries globally in the field of scientific research, positioned as one of the top five nations in the field of space exploration. The country has regularly undertaken space missions, including missions to the moon and the famed Polar Satellite Launch Vehicle. India is likely to take a leading role in launching satellites for the SAARC nations, generating revenue by offering its space facilities for use to other countries. The government has introduced multiple policies aimed at projecting India as a science and technology powerhouse and promoting both public and private sector involvement in the R&D practice. As a result, India's gross expenditure on R&D has been consistently increasing over the years. The government has also implemented several fellowship schemes to nurture the human capacity for advanced research in the country. India's rise as a superpower is driven by a multitude of factors, from its vast and growing economy to its massive and young population. With a strong and growing military, a thriving technology sector, and a rapidly expanding diplomatic footprint, India is well positioned to play an increasingly influential role in the global community. From its position as a leader in cutting-edge fields like biotechnology and artificial intelligence to its investment in renewable energy and sustainable development, India is demonstrating a clear commitment to building a more sustainable and equitable future. With its rising economic, military, and technological power, India is poised to become a major player in the coming decades. Whether it's through its role in the G20, its leadership in global organizations like the United Nations, or its influence on the world stage through its diplomatic relationships with other nations, India is poised to make its mark as a superpower in the years ahead. So, as we look to the future, it's clear that India is on the rise and that its ascent to the top tier of global power is only a matter of time. Thanks for watching this video. Don't forget to give a like, and if you want to see more videos, press the subscribe button. Until next time, take care of yourself. Peace.